What's up everyone? It's Mike Bendy from Fred Dyer Guitars coming to you with a first of its kind. This is a wonderful Monarch 5 headless, but check this out. It's the first time being done in a dovetail neck joint. This one's nice and lightweight. It's got a one piece ash body, three piece maple neck, ebony fingerboard, blank with side dots and an ivory wood top. We're using Nordstrand noise canceling pickups that are in a JJ casing. And of course, a nice abalone butterfly, mother of pearl F. This thing is just a dream to play. Really nice high-end brilliance from the ebony board. And then the punch from the ash. It's fantastic. For the bridge, we got the hip shot A style. This is a 19 millimeter spacing. Just an absolute dream. It's got some nice thick flame in there. But today we're here to talk about the standard four band preamp. I'll do a little A, B without a preamp, with the preamp. We'll see how it sounds. We got volume tone. Moving over, we got the pickup pan, the balance. Then we have bass, treble, low mid, and high mid functionality all under your fingertips. Tune in the room, blow some people's heads off. It's gonna be great. Let's go passive with the neck. Let's see how that sounds. Now I'm just gonna turn on the preamp. This is flat. The bass line I was doing before boosted the bass to like two o'clock, left the treble right in the center, and then I'll do low mid up to two o'clock too. Let's see how that sounds. I like that. With a little bit of that, like kind of palm muting, beefens up that low end. I'll go bass flat. I'll stay in the neck pickup. High mid, roll back the treble to like 11 o'clock, just, just a little bit. I like the bass boost a, a bit for the neck pickup. Here's bridge, passive, full bridge. Here's just preamp turned on, flat. I'm gonna boost the bass. I will take the treble back to 10 o'clock. I'll boost the low mid to two, take the high mid to 11. Right 
right? Here's a cool little groove my brother John Bendy wrote. Preamp off. This is both pickups right in the middle. Here we go. Up an octave sounds dope too. Now with the preamp on, everything flat. Here we go. Right? That sounds dope, right? Just like that. I'm gonna boost the treble to one o'clock. Bass, let's go to two o'clock on bass. I'll turn the low mid down to 11 and high mid, one o'clock, just a little bit. There you go. It's a little too bright for me. I'll wrote. Let me roll the treble back to flat, high mid, flat, low mid, boosted to one o'clock, and I'll keep the bass at two. So I'll do a groove right now. I will we'll leave the high mids in the center. Let's do low mids, two o'clock. Let's, let's get a little risky. Ready? Let's add some high mids to the low mids, see how that sounds. I'll go to two o'clock as well. I like that a lot. Let me take the low mid to center, leave that high mid. Let's go to three o'clock, see how high that goes. Go back to the center, take away the low mid, and leave the high mid in the center, I'll go to 10 o'clock. It's a little too dark for me. So let's leave the low mid there, 10 o'clock. Let's go high mid to two o'clock. And now I'll take the low mid back to the center, then I'll take the high mid down to 10 o'clock. Mm -hmm. 
Let's do flat bass, treble, 10 o'clock, and high mid at 10, but low mid at two. Right, guys thank you so much for checking out our video on the standard four band preamp as you can hear the tonal possibilities are endless whatever tone you're looking for you can accomplish it with the standard four band we'll see you next time stay positive and thanks for the support take care <laughs>